I want to open up today with a quick correction, and that is that yesterday I was talking about how there was a WWE performer who tested positive, and everybody in WWE found out about it when we did, when the story broke on social media. And I was told from one person that, in fact, a mass text was sent out to the performers right before it went out on social media. So they were alerted before it actually broke, uh, where everybody else heard about it. Now, what I was also told was that the communication in NXT and on the WWE main roster is different. So it is possible that one or the other uh, received a mass text prior to it being released on social media, and the other did not. So I don't know for sure, but I, I did hear from somebody who did get a text from WWE prior to it going out on social media, so I want to make that abundantly clear. It was not, however, five days prior, like the last time somebody tested positive. WWE, everybody in the WWE was informed, and we found out five days later. Uh, difference here is probably that... You know, they had taping scheduled for Tuesday, and as a result of this, like, everything was canceled uh, yesterday. Everybody was basically out there doing coronavirus testing. They were standing in line for hours. It was uh, quite, the, quite the rigmarole, but they did, in fact, test everybody. And as far as I know, there are still people today who are waiting on their results. So because of this... They were going to tape, I don't have the entire list, but I think it was like Raw, SmackDown, two NXTs, 205 Live, main event. I mean, they were taping like 10 hours worth of stuff today. And because of, of the wait, everybody not knowing exactly, I shouldn't say not everybody, but like some people have gotten the results back. Mojo Rawley has, has sent out, he actually, you know, did social media about being uh, negative for COVID-19. But anyway, there are some people that still hadn't got their results back as of just a little while ago. So as a result, SmackDown, the SmackDown taping today has been canceled, and I believe it has been rescheduled for the 26th, which, if I can find my, my calendar here, a professional would have done this before we went on the air, but I didn't. Anyway, I think they're going to tape SmackDown next Friday, which is which is cutting it pretty close. Uh, somebody can correct me if that's not the 26th. But the SmackDown for this Friday has already been taped. So they're good for Friday. They are in the middle of taping main event 205 Live, and they're going to be taping Raw. The NXT show tonight is going live. So it'll be a live show tonight on the USA Network. And I believe they're taping next week's NXT after tonight's live show goes off the air. They are once again letting friends and family in. So that's that's going to continue here. And as far as I know, like the people who haven't got their results yet, they're just sort of they're wandering around, just waiting to get that call. So that is the update. The only other thing I was told was uh, people are being told no photos of of the... Uh, the testing process, what's going on outside the building, none of that. I don't know why. That's just what they were told. So that's the update as of right now. We cannot allow any outside distractions. No reality is allowed in the world of the WWE universe. No, sir. Can't, can't happen, cannot be done. Nothing happens outside the universe.